What's going on, y'all? So I'm out here with the gang. We got them all over here. Steve just pulled up. Uh, just smooth evening, just shooting some bows, getting ready for bow season to come in. Y'all know, got to put in that work. That way we don't have any bad shots to take place. We're about to get, get ready, sling some arrows, give a few tips here and there, and answer some of the questions that I've been asked about my bow, what kind of bow I shoot, etc. So we'll get everything ready and let's sling some arrows. I'm just going to wax up my string a little bit before we start okay. shooting because... Hey, yeah. Well, leave. You don't mind if I use some of that, do you? No. Nah. Or actually, hold on. I'm going to have some in here. I've been uh I'll wax my string every year. Yeah, I got waxed at the house. I thought I had it in here. Oh, walk to Mom's ready to ride. Purple. Ready to ride. How many areas you got? I got three. Wait, Using a uh, radio wait. weave. Oh. Yeah. Radio weave is 200s. Uh, I think I cut mine at 29 inches, is what I cut mine at. Of course, you'd cut yours to your own draw length, but that's what mine is. Okay, you got that uh, bow wax? Yeah, that's right there. Dang, dude. What? Oh, never mind. It's just cold. I thought I'd work. Shoot, I, ain't, I don't think I've ever put this kind of wax on my butt. I just... Uh, I've always used that solid... I don't even know if it's the same stuff. Like, what's the liquid for, right? Liquid's wax. It is? It's the same thing. The scorpion venom? Yeah. That's what I got. I've never but, even seen the liquid wax. In my opinion, this probably works better. Yeah. Like to keep these little, uh, the little no. pieces where it's coming. Yeah. Well, well this is. Really I bought this bow in 2011. This is the same string that came on it. I think I bought this one in probably 15. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we're laughing at, y'all. We're laughing at little man in the pool over there. <laughs> Liam. 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 What you doing, man? Huh? <laughs> Don't shoot the GoPro. Watch Antonio's bow's going to be shooting like two foot left. It's just going to pull right through it. <laughs> Please don't say that. Huh, what the heck did I do with Your release. my release? I literally just put it on. Ah, I took it off the way from here. There it is. Hang on, I'm gonna change for him. Hey, Liam. Oh, I, oh well, I thought you were about to shoot. Uh, first, you already range it. Yeah, this is gonna be. You're at like 19 <laughs> yards, so first, okay, 20, 20, uh, first shot's gonna be 21 yards. Jazz. Jazz, here. <laughs> nice. Send it. Uh, because we're all so tight on arrows, I'm probably going to like uh, shoot around, take them out, 
That way we don't accidentally Robin Hood or hit somebody's arrow. I look like I'm a Robin Hood now. I'm not doing I'm gonna be older. I'm gonna be Get sweet. He's fine. Hey. So my shot was a little left, Matt was in the black, and Steve was high high left. So did I say left on mine or right? I was, I was a little right. Matt was in the black, Steve was high left. Almost same exact spot. I'm sorry. Almost same exact spot. A little higher than the last time, but I'm still in the back. Long shot all day. Huh? Long shot, huh? <laughs> yeah. Same spot. Same spot. We're not going to make any changes today to our sights because we're so close and this is the first day we're shooting. And, um, and we're, we're grouping pretty much the same with two arrows so far. But if you do change your sights, you got to remember, you got to chase your arrow. So if you're shooting high, you move your pin up. Don't move your pin down. You're shooting low, you move your pin down to bring your arrow up. Sounds weird, but the easiest way to remember it is chase your arrow with your pin. So you shoot high, move it up. Shooting low, move it down. You're shooting left, move it left. You know, and then shooting right, move it right. That'll, that'll get you in the right spot. Y'all want to move back to 30? Or y'all want to shoot 20 one more time? 320. I got that set. 30 yards. I'll shoot. We'll shoot another 20. Dang. Pack a We're going back up to 30 yards. Uh, I'm, I'm about to just shoot it like it is. All right. I'm, I'm a aim. No, no, you're good. I'm a, uh, where the V comes down. I'm aim like that high. Uh, I'm gonna be aiming kind of like that high of where the point is of the V. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna be aiming in the bottom of the white. That was dead center. Got it. Got it. <laughs> All right. When I'm practicing. I like to draw back exactly how I'd be drawn back when I'm hunting. So that's why you don't see me move much when I draw back. That was the bottom one, wasn't it? Yeah. I can't see from here. <laughs> yeah, it's getting about. We kind of waited a little too late to cut to shoot. It's about too dark now. Y'all shoot before I got here? Uh -uh. He shot a couple times before I got out here, but um, but shoot, you got plenty of deer walks out right now. I'm I'm sticking him. Yeah. But you gotta imagine. I mean, look how dark it is in the woods already, guys. Well, that was short and sweet. Um. It looks like we're all pretty good. Steve might, next time we shoot, Steve might do a little changing on his. He might have to move down some. But it's, it's getting a little hard to see to be making any kind of changes right now. So um, let me show you guys my bow because I get asked a lot what kind of bow I use. That is my bow right there. A Strother Infinity. Dual cam. On that bad boy, you know, packing a punch. Yeah, I've had this bow since 2011. Uh, it's only the second bow I've ever owned in my life. I started with a bear bow. I shot it for a couple years and then 
spent got me a nice expensive back in the day this bow fully set up I think I paid like close to 900 if I remember correctly so I stepped my game up a good bit and I mean it's been whacking deer ever since so no reason for me to upgrade right now I know there's a lot better on the market but I'm not all about that fast and powerful stuff I'm just trying to put back straps in the freezer appreciate you guys watching y'all make sure y'all smash that thumbs up for me and I'll see y'all next time